If a cat comes into the shelter and tests positive for FIV, oftentimes those cats will be euthanized right away. Gladys Knight is a stunningly beautiful black cat who came in from the East Valley Shelter about a month ago. When Gladys came in, she was in great condition, big robust girl, a little fluffy, so she did need a little bit of grooming, but otherwise she was in great health. Upon intake here at our adoption center, all the animals are tested and she came back positive for FIV. Some people call FIV kitty AIDS. It's feline immunodeficiency virus. It tends to inhibit the immune system of a cat, but most cats live with it their whole lives and very rarely get sick from it. A cat cannot give FIV to a human. It's hard enough for them to give it to another cat, so humans are completely safe interacting with an FIV cat. People become afraid when you have any kind of an illness associated with an animal. It makes people think that they're going to get a sick animal, which is not the case with FIV. There's no treatment for FIV. It's usually just keeping your cat healthy, doing everything you can to keep it healthy. I've seen FIV cats live to be into 18, 19 years old and die from other issues that had nothing to do with FIV. So their lifespan can be the same length as any other cat. Best Friends Animal Society has been around for uh, 28 years. Our national mission is to bring about a time of no more homeless pets. In order to do that, we need to work with local communities, government, and fellow rescues and shelters to encourage people to adopt. Part of the reason why Gladys hasn't been adopted, I think, is because, you know, we have all these other adult cats that don't have FIV and, you know, FIV still scares people a little. I think there's two misconceptions about FIV. Most people believe that FIV cats are going to be sick or more likely to have medical issues, which is not the case. Also, that they can't live with other cats, which they can. I myself have an FIV positive cat who lives with all of my other cats and has never had a problem. Gladys Knight is adorable. She's a, such a cool cat. She's very wise and very affectionate. She is just a very, very nice cat and the perfect cat for an example of an FIV positive cat because she is healthy and sturdy and gets along with other cats and isn't where you look at a cat and think that cat might have an issue. She's going to be great in any home she goes to. Hi, I'm the host of Ask a Vet. You're watching The Pet Collective Cares. Don't forget to subscribe.